Down Down, presented by BSC Investors Protection Fund. After exiting its uh, joint venture with Tishman Spire in 2008, India's largest private investment firm, ICICI Venture, is looking to exit its stake in yet another project, and this time nearly for 400 crores. Definitely. In fact, sources uh, have indicated to Bloomberg TV in that, that PJ and GIC is looking to buy ICICI Venture's stake in the Wave Rock Business Park located in Hyderabad. Sapna Dhanwani standing by with the exclusive details there. Sapna, what's the latest as far as the real estate sector is concerned here? Well, absolutely. ICICI Venture has finally found a buyer for its stake after two years of announcing its exit from Tishman Spears Business Park, Wave Rock, located in northwest Hyderabad, that is Gachibali. The project that has completed its second phase recently has seen serious buyer interest from Singapore-based sovereign fund GIC. Now, ICICI Venture is looking to sell its equity stake for nearly 400 crore rupees. The deal will include a debt stake of about 150 crore rupees as well as an equity stake of nearly 250 crore rupees. ICICI Venture had bought the stake in 2006 for nearly 200 crore rupees. Remember, ICICI Venture had ended the joint venture with Tishman Spear back in 2008 but had held on to equity stake in its projects. Now, this will be the first project that ICICI Ventures will be looking to exit with Tishman Spear. Such also, sources have indicated to Bloomberg TV India that ICICI Venture will also be looking to sell its stake in the other two projects that it holds with Tishman Spear in the near future. Clearly, this means that ICICI Venture Venture has made no loss or gain with its investment in this particular Wave Rock project. In response to Bloomberg TV India, Dishman Spear declined to comment. While ICIC Venture has said, and I quote, we would not like to comment on market speculations relating to our deals and transactions. However, GIC failed to respond to Bloomberg TV India's query. Countdown, presented by BSC, Investors Protection Fund.